Hello guys, my name is Tara from Tara Arts Movie and welcome to a uh, Handcraft Tutorial Part 3. And today we're gonna be talking about how to um, compose all of this, all element that we already create in After Effects. But before that, I want to teach you how to create your your own ground crack with Ray Fire, just like this. All right. So instead, you download a, some image from the internet. Maybe it, it will be better if you can uh, make it yourself. So we just reset this. And then the, uh, you, all you wanna do is go to box, and you're gonna create a box. So create a box, just like that. Maybe, maybe we're gonna make it wide actually, really, really wide. And there you go. And the next thing you're gonna wanna do, of course, you're gonna open the Ray Fire plugin. Remember, Ray Fire is third-party plugin, so you have to buy it. And then you're gonna go to simulation, make sure the box is selected and add and go to ray explosion and set this for an eye bomb impact and we're gonna set this like this 72 80 actually it's whatever you want and fragment in, in impact objects and I'm gonna make some fragmentation and there you go you're already done and the next thing you're gonna want to do is go to space warps and change it from force to geometric deformable and bomb and you're gonna create a bomb let's say here and then uh, you're gonna go to modify make sure the bomb is selected and strength to one and fall off fall off on make sure the fall off is on and make it kinda wide make sure it's not that wide just like that and then you're gonna go to the minimum and set this up to about 15 this is also maybe around that and then you're gonna go to gravity make it zero we don't need gravity here and the next thing you're gonna want to do is um, from the top view over here you're gonna select all of this box and then bind to space warps into the bomb and then you're gonna move the bomb into the middle and let's see here if we uh, go to the timeline and you can set the bow maybe a little up there, you know. There you go. You just create your own ground crack. If you if you render this, it'll be like that. So have fun with that. And if you're already done, just render it as image. So to render it as image, you press F10 and set this to HD actually. HD, and then a single frame. So, this is what you're gonna uh, render. Make sure you choose this box, perspective view, not the front view, not here, but perspective view. And you're gonna render this. And let's say you're gonna save it to desktop. And all formats now, we're gonna save it to JPEG. And ground crack. We're gonna name it ground crack. Save it and render it should be very fast all right so the next thing we're gonna do we're gonna go to after effects all right guys so here we are in after effects and this is from our recent tutorial which is part one all right so make sure you go to the, the first pre-com so this is the first um, project and uh, not project the composition when there's no shaky camera and all and this is what we are going to need and then we're gonna let double left click on this box over here on this project to import and go to desktop anyway uh, we go to whatever you save this debris um, footage that we already create in 3d studios max alright so the first thing you wanna do we're gonna add some ground crack that we already create too so let's put it in the, in the um, footage and then we're gonna create a mask we don't need the black area create a mask and then you're gonna set this from toggle switch like if you are on this position uh, you're gonna set this so you can find this normal and etc and make sure this ground crack image is highlighted and then you go to this part overlay to hard mix well you're gonna find the best for you maybe hard light for me 
and then you're gonna scale it down it's the crack and you're gonna make sure it's where landing so you kinda touch the ground like this aha uh -huh. so you're gonna want to crack um, out you can break it so the crack will appear in that um, time and then all you're gonna do is create some mask Get some mask here just like that it doesn't have to be perfect cause it will covered by the 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 ever the, the debris anyway so it have to be perfect just like that and then next thing you're gonna want to do you're gonna import this debris the rpf file to the um, composition and let's see when you touch the ground uh, the debris will be just like that so boom and again my favorite tool alt begin bracket <laughs> alt begin bracket all right so um boom and it's like that actually the crack you can create that um like a hollow actually i i made a mistake the crack is not that good but you can make it by yourself after watching my tutorial of course and then as you can see it's kind of too black um well you can go to evax color correction hue and saturation basically you're gonna do the color correction here actually it's enough <laughs> we already created uh, if you are on, on X asphalt um, well it will be good but I think we're gonna have some curve red original up a little bit just a little bit and then the blue channel down basically it's just color corrected I'm not gonna uh, showing you the detail of it basically I just want to show you that you have to color correct it but it's not that important so I think it doesn't have to be good I just I'm just gonna showing you um, uh, the next so uh, actually you already create some good uh, Hancock style here <laughs> Next thing you're gonna want to do, maybe you're gonna back to the uh, last um, footage, and when you when you hit the ground, it will be appear. Actually, we're gonna set this um, when you really hit the ground. So that time and this debris will be appear from that all right so back to our last composition I think it it's pretty good all right guys so that's it um, actually we're already finished here so maybe you can add some layer new adjustment layer and maybe you can find uh, in my channel you can go search my um, free color correction presets and we're gonna use 2013 here and there you go you just create some Hancock um, like in a Hancock movie alright guys so that's the basic thing that you're gonna wanna do um, this is my tutorial and thank you for watching and you can add some motion blur in this um, uh, debris and there you go and maybe the crack you can make it more well more convincing than I did here the crack is not that good uh, you can make it by using X uh, ray fire in 3 studios max alright guys so that's it this is the coolest tutorial I have ever created and thank you for watching and if you find this helpful please subscribe by hit the subscribe button of course you can read Aha, uh -huh. that's a bad joke. Alright, so guys, subscribe for more cool videos and tutorial. My name is Tara from Tara Arts Movie, and I'm kind of sick today. <coughs> See that? So, I think I'm gonna sleep after I upload this. Thank you for watching. See ya.